Humanity is always in perpetual motion, and large-scale road infrastructure is a result of this drive to go somewhere. Intersections have always been a challenge even for the experienced drivers. But what would you say looking at these most complex transportation junctions gathered from all around the world? It's a true nightmare for motorists. These products of engineering are just as impressive as the seven wonders of the world. Today we present to you the most unusual car interchanges in the world. From Los Angeles to Shanghai, where even experienced drivers might find it difficult to navigate. Let's get started. Shanghai is often referred to as the Pearl of the Orient because there is truly much to see here. This largest city in China is famous not only for its reverence for ancient traditions, but also for its high-tech structures, which are increasing in number every year. The Nanpu Bridge, located in Shanghai, became the country's first cable-stayed bridge with a total length of 8,346 meters. The dimensions of the Nanpu Bridge are impressive. Two reinforced concrete towers rise 150 meters, each attached to 22 pairs of steel cables that support the structure. But the main advantage of the bridge is its interchange or ramp. According to the architect's design, the interchange resembles a dragon's tail spiraling around. Other roads are connected to it, ensuring high traffic capacity. It features a circular design of an elevated road that allows for efficient use of space. Initially, about 14,000 to 17,000 vehicles pass through it daily. But by 2023, this number has increased to several hundred thousand vehicles daily. The roads in Dubai, as well as in all the Arab Emirates, are excellent. You not only enjoy driving on them, but also take pleasure in simple contemplation. The intricately designed and impressively sized new interchange in Dubai, which has become the largest in the Emirates, features 11 overpasses and tunnels. It was constructed at the site of a traditional roundabout intersection in the country, specifically to accommodate the Grand Dubailand project that was under construction. The interchange's construction also involved expanding the roadways of the adjacent Um Sukim Highway and Al Quidr Road. The city administration invested $111.6 million in the new interchange. Local authorities consistently urge motorists to pay close attention and not rush while following the road signs installed on the new interchange in order to avoid taking the wrong direction and reduce the number of accidents. China is renowned for its often intricate and confusing flyover intersections. But the Shanxiong Interchange in Gian, the capital of the mountainous Guizhou province, is the only one that truly resembles giant American roller coasters designed exclusively for cars and trucks. Construction of the Shanxiong Interchange began in 2009, but this massive road complex was completed relatively recently. It comprises 18 different flyovers in eight directions on five levels, with the tallest standing at a height of 37 meters above the ground. This incredibly complex infrastructure project is referred to as a nightmare for drivers trying to find their way. Social media users often note that even GPS navigators can get confused by the five different levels of the road. However, official sources claim that all directions and exits on the interchange are clearly marked, and even if you make a wrong turn, it's always easy to correct your course. Still considering this grand road structure, it is hard to imagine that driving through it will be an easy task. The automobile interchange, named after Harry Pregerson, is located in the Watts and Athens neighborhoods of Los Angeles, California. Opened 30 years ago in 1993, it features 34 intertwining ramps and spans across five levels of roadways. Movement within this interchange is possible in all directions, and it also accommodates city transport and metro routes. Since its opening in 1993, almost 5 billion cars have traveled on these roads. The Judge Harry Pregerson Interchange is recognized as one of the most challenging in the world. About 650,000 vehicles pass through it per day. In 1994, the final part of the movie Speed was filmed at this interchange. In one scene, a bus had to fly over an unfinished part of the construction. Experts noted that the opening of the interchange made traffic safer, reduced congestion, and improved air quality in the city. This transportation interchange is one of the largest in the world. It comprises six levels and accommodates thousands of vehicles per hour. This engineering marvel can be found in Puxi, the historic center of Shanghai. This viaduct in Shanghai is the busiest transportation hub in the city. Just imagine, a huge crossroads with a confusing interchange, six levels of bridges and ramps intertwining with each other, forming another puzzle for drivers. And during the morning rush hour, it's quite easy to miss your turn 
Kathipara Junction is an important road junction in Chennai, India. It is located at Allen Dur south of Gindi at the intersection of the Grand Southern Trunk Road, Inner Ring Road, Anna Salai, and Poonamali Road. The Kathipara Bridge was constructed in 2008, with the project costing about $60 million. One of the largest cloverleaf flyovers in Asia, the Kathipara Bridge is renowned for its size. With a total of eight ramps on three levels, it can accommodate more than 200,000 vehicles daily. The bridge is a local landmark and a tourist attraction due to its distinctive design. One of the most terrible and confusing road interchanges in the world is situated in Atlanta in the state of Georgia. The interchange is located at the intersection of two highways, number 85 and number 285. Officially known as the Tom Moreland Interchange, it is popularly referred to as the Spaghetti Junction. Constructed in the mid-1980s, it was named in honor of Tom Moreland, one of the leading experts in the field of road construction in the United States. Today, this interchange accommodates around 300,000 vehicles daily. The intricate web of roads is so tangled that a driver's mistake during a turn can cost several liters of fuel, nerves, and lost time to turn around and continue on the correct route. The Turbine Interchange is an alternative four-way directional interchange. It is located in Jacksonville, Florida. Also known as a Whirlpool Interchange, this structure consists of left-turning ramps sweeping around a central hub, creating a spiral pattern of right-hand traffic. This type of junction is rarely built due to the large amount of land required for constructing the sweeping roads. The intersection was completed in 2008 at a total cost of $80 million, improving transportation between Jacksonville's Beltway and Butler Boulevard. The latter was nicknamed the Road to Nowhere when it first opened in 1979 due to light use and the once undeveloped areas it served. The final structure blends form and function so seamlessly that the interchange has gained national attention from above, prompting some to wonder whether its serene balance of concrete caught in a perpetual dance was the result of Photoshop wizardry. Throngs of cars zoom along its serpentine arms and carefully intertwined on and off ramps, seemingly indifferent to the elegance they traverse. The Gravelly Hill Interchange in Birmingham has earned the nickname Spaghetti Junction due to its winding and intersecting multi-level roads. The nickname became popular after a Birmingham Evening Mail reporter described the layout of the yet-to-be-built interchange as a cross between a plate of spaghetti and an unsuccessful attempt at knotting a Staffordshire knot. The Spaghetti Junction is simultaneously loathed and loved by all drivers. In the Guinness World Records, this Birmingham interchange is dubbed the most complex in the United Kingdom. However, it offers the opportunity to save time on many routes. For instance, driving from London to Liverpool can be shortened by 90 minutes using this interchange. The Gravelly Hill interchange covers an area of 42 hectares. Across five different levels, 559 concrete columns up to 24.4 meters high support the structure. Engineers had to elevate 21.7 kilometers of highway to accommodate two railway lines, three canals, and two rivers. Construction began in 1968, and the interchange was opened on May 24, 1972, two months later than planned. On average, 200,000 vehicles travel along the interchange's highways daily. Write in the comments which of the transportation interchanges impressed you the most. If you liked the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the Kara Show channel. Also on our channel, there are many other interesting videos. See you later.